Well, the nuke is back on Grand Nixon Island with Chris. Press Ratu to dodge. This makes it harder for enemies to hit you. So you and the Black Widow interesting the hard. Any idea yes, we were very hard. Yeah, usually it's when the Russians are getting hit hard, it's yeah. Black Widow, and anyway, she's with never mind. You wiped out the Russian facilities on the docks, including a tank they'd somehow smuggled past Homeland Security. You they, better not be playing hide the zucchini. And then you I'm and not even green, man. Blew it right out of the water. Speaking of blowing it out of the water, how is blowing it out of the water? Someone named Krikov Castle? And then you gave her the wind tunnel? A nasty customer. Bloody red smear in every intel database known to man. Oh no, that's Black Widow went never mind. Really pissed him off, right? Ripping through his Russian burks like that? This stuff ringing any bells? Krikov? Grand Nixon Island? Not very good with names. Remember bodies, though. I remember well, yours. After you, didn't he? Now, why would you just open your apartment door without first checking to see who was there? Cause, uh, uh I, I don't know. <laughs> I swear the cutscenes and loading screens are longer than this actual. <laughs> Need to rearm before hitting the Merc's base. Damn, Jill must have made another batch of cookies. I said without moving my mouth like old Resident Evil games. He punched me in my tit. Why would he punch me in my tit? And it was one of my two favorite ones, too. That bastard. Oh god, he's about to reach for my taint. Oh. <laughs> well, that didn't do shit. Are you having trouble? No. This is how you have to fight him. <laughs> you need me in my butthole! <laughs> Have some refreshments. <laughs> Would you like some beer with that? Oh. Oh. Hey, look, you have the the wrench, and then you can get kicked in the shin like a kindergarten. The corkscrew or whatever. <laughs> oh. Wow, that did nothing. Whoa! He was fast. How about some education for you? This is a computer. Welcome to the interweave. We Dweeb. have technology. Dude. <laughs> he threw me by the taint. He sounds like Schultz from uh, Hogan's Heroes. He kind of does. I know nothing. Hogan, oh how dare you let the Russian into your house? Also, that's the wrong thing. Any last requests? Big point. Yeah, it's what I'm gonna say any time. Ow! He tried to uppercut you. Yeah, he uppercut me in the ribs. Get up, fool! Oh. Oh, what a haymaker. I felt that one. In the dick. Yes! <laughs> I thought he was cupping his balls like it hurt. Ow! One of my fav two favorite testicles. This is a TV. Ever heard of it? Uh, high definition ass whooping. Wow, that was... That was it. See? Wow. Four and a half minutes. Damn. <laughs> I told you. Short. There you go. Yeah, that's one of the few levels I'm good at. God, he has a butt. God, he has a butt. Well, say so yeah, from up the fucking window. <laughs> don't, don't, don't get any on you. Wow. 
Yeah, the blood is from the pee hole. <laughs> that I tell me he got up and walked away. He got up and walked away. God damn it. Yeah, the blood trail was from when I threw the cleaver at his pee hole. Mm. I think this might be one of, if not the longest level Green in the game. Got it coming to him enough. Yeah, I would keep the sniper rifle. And then whatever you want. <laughs> Bang back! Got it coming to him and I'm gonna this is for a time when size matters. I got, I got a big one. What I'm trying to say is, X gonna give it to you. <laughs> 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 you can quick whatever. I can't Thanks believe you just sat there trying to rap. <laughs> Man, I'd hate to meet him in a dark alley. You might know Although I have way. met him in a dark alley and propositioned him from sex or for sex. And boy was he rough. And he sounded like Schultz from Hogan's Heroes. Gave me a bit of a chubby. Hello, they named the whole island after me. Then you bailed out over the island. <laughs> and it's got trees and shit. Oh! You breathe in the fresh air like, oh! <laughs> Are you okay? I heard the clunk. Sorry. No, don't need to apologize. I'm just worried about you okay. Nyx is one of my favorite characters in this feature He's so oh, funny. Yeah. Not even the map of Epcot Center. Hold together, baby. Oh. Hold together. Oh, so he has all the unsold copies of A Good Day to Die Hard? Yep. So that's where they dump them. Haru, get this shitty movie off my island. Extended director's cut my ass. You cut out McLean's daughter. What the hell was that about? Like Natasha? You're the boss, big guy. You're the big boss guy? <laughs> He's the big Lebowski. Just about a yeah, that plane really tied the room together. He just jump out, god damn it. You forgot your free penis! And if you got a parachute... Haru, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not mopping that up. <laughs> All the enemies are headless Agnew. This path should lead the creep cow's base. Apparently I beat... For, what the... F I'm trying to aim on it. Being in the South Pacific, gravity no longer applied to me. Okay, I was just kidding. Snipers in the towers. Yeah, this is why you needed the sniper rifle. And you missed. And you didn't. Oh god, now I'm having flashbacks to the Pacific. <laughs> Man, that was a depressing ass. Oh! Oh! I oh, shot oh that's right. We didn't turn off the I shot him in the dick and he flew. Yeah, when you shoot that guy in the dick, he flies. When I throw a, a cleaver at the Russian's dick, he doesn't go anywhere. You gonna piss on your pig? Oh. Ooh. Oh, there goes his head. You gave him the Gallagher! That's really gonna hurt because he has no hair to push on the bullet. <laughs> uh, oh, Is that a tar pit? Are you gonna find Cole and Rusty there? Oh wait, nothing. Why? Why? Well, wrong thing, push. <laughs> like I'm insane. I regret my actions. <laughs> Blowing guys 50 yards, getting shot in the taint. Jeez. I like how one of them felt like a domino. I like how I just kind of gave up. <laughs> right? Like, like, oh. <laughs> What's the point of living if I'm gonna 
fall down a cliff. What the hell kind of bird was that? Oh, some kind of the fucked up bird. The one that was dying because he saw a castle coming, so they played dead. Like, ah, what the hell? <laughs> well, you remind me of the uh, bird in Aladdin. Oh, Iago. Yeah. Jafar! That's the only thing I could do. <laughs> because he I made still a... say that he would make a great Galact uh, Galactus. I go around eating planets. It's just what I do. It's not the Barcinal. And then also, too, when he's getting ready to eat a planet. Alright, Trimux, I'm gonna eat ya! What happened to Captain America? Oh, he got old and died. <laughs> well, that's sad. <laughs> I was hoping to eat him. No, eat a planet he's on. No. I like my planets with a little side of America's ass. I don't know why it's turning into like gravelly Peter Falk voice. <laughs> Peter Falk is Galactus. Uh, one more thing, man, before I eat this planet. Uh, where were you on the night of the 15th? <laughs> uh oh. I, I was like how they just get blown he away. He just went into and the then wall. He just like phased into the wall. Well, I mean, this is Marvel Comics, so anything's possible. But did you hear about how there's talks that uh, uh, Disney's thinking on bringing Beyonce in for Black Panther 2? And guess what they're considering having her play? Storm. Yup. Oh, Christ. I, mean, I honestly think that they have a perfect storm with Nakia. I am sick and tired of Disney squandering a perfectly good Lupita on nothing roles. Yeah. That they purport as being big and important and then ultimately amount to fuck nothing. They already did it with Star Wars. I really don't want them to do it with Marvel. Hell, I'd rather Okoye be Storm than Beyonce. Anybody. Although, admittedly, Beyonce can't act. It's just like... I, just don't I have a bad taste in my mouth after Lion King. Because mm -hmm. nobody fucking tried in that thing. James Earl Jones didn't try in Lion King. And the, what the fuck was that? Oh, he went like... Ugh. See, now I lost my train of thought. Donald Glover is a great actor. Didn't try. Uh, Chew... I always get the name wrong. She would tell you, G4, Chai, uh, Chai whatever. Tell. He's a great actor. Didn't try. So disappointed by his version of Be Prepared, although I'm sure that wasn't his fault. I mean, he fucking got out sang by Jeremy Irons, for Christ's sake. Who, by the way, does not sing that entire song. He fucked up, so they got out like a sound alike. I think they got uh, Jim Cummings. Yeah. Yeah. Who seamlessly. Sounds like Jeremy Irons. Yep. Hubert Godfrey would be better for Storm. I'm calling on the power of the wind and the thunder. To fly! Right? All I know is they better make Storm like how she was in uh, X-Men the Animated Series where she would always do like this 20 minute monologue about the wind and the, the power of the, the rain and whatever before she even used her powers. Mm -hmm. That was my favorite thing about Storm. It's like, would you just get to the zapping people with the lightning already? You might want to pick up a different gun instead of the... Uh, Sniper. Oh, I'm all done with the sniper now? I think you are for now. <gasps> I think. <clears throat> That'll do. <laughs> like, pa, pa, pa. Do, 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 do. <gasps> oh, ow. Ooh, that did not sound good. I like how they kind of look. 
I'm kind of like trying to like break out into song and dance. I would pay good money to see Punisher the musical. Jeez, what a drama. Since now it's owned by Disney, just imagine him going on a killing spree singing bippity boppity boo. <laughs> just brain splattering everywhere. <laughs> Instead of a magic wand, you're just stabbing people in the head. Like, <laughs> yep. Okay, I will pay to see that. Especially if it's John Bernthal. Yes. And then after he's all done, he just like rubs his head. Yep. Get your asses out of here now. He no. didn't do that in uh, Night at the Museum, did he? That would have been hysterical. Was he in Night at the Museum? He was Al Capone. Right. He was Al Capone. Yeah. That would have been great. I've only seen each movie once and I remember. I see a school guy. I forget what you can do to him. Oh, you bash him with the jeep door. I remember this one. We're gonna find some decent weapons. You cannot make me talk. I have great three concussion. I can't remember my father. There go the piano lessons. <laughs> no surrender! I will be surrendering immediately. No surrender! Well, it's either. Oh, I guess you have the grenades anyway. But you have two guns. You can never have too many bombs. Now I'm just gonna stuff this down the front of my pants. So sure, it'll be fine. <laughs> my god, he had a big dick. Oh, that's not my dick, son. Uh, pack up dynamite, or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> just stand there. I'll be fine. So, since these are all Russians here, I wonder if they'll call a, um, a wedding a Soviet Union. That makes sense. You know, I expect <laughs> that kind of talk from this one here. <laughs> Not I have you. my moments. <laughs> I mean, I, I I do subscribe to the theory that if a couple spends enough time together, they pick up each other's bad habits. So, there you go. Now you're picking up his puns. Well, they're not bad. <laughs> they are when you do them. But when she does them, they're cold. Because I find good ones. <laughs> or I think of good ones. Also, she knows what things are most of the time, unlike you guy who I had to describe what a fleshlight was. And a guy who didn't know the word foxy. Where do I go? Yeah, how do you not know what foxy is? I never used it in a sentence. Alright, we'll figure this one out on the next episode. We're already at like 19 minutes. <laughs> <laughs>